tested the Ford KA to airbags standard made in Brazil. This car was tested already in the 2015 protocol and the car reached a four stars only in the frontal test. We are now uh, fulfilled the requirement according to the 2016 protocol, so we also tested the side impact as we did with other models. The result in that condition would be a zero star for adults and three stars for the child occupant protection. We see the red chest in the driver on the side impact and that explains the zero stars for this car. We are now uh, watching the frontal crash test we have performed in 2015. The car uh, reached a four star result. Uh, good structure, even though the head uh, bottomed out the airbag on the driver's side. And that actually made the car lose a little bit of points, but anyway, a four star result was <coughs> very, it is very good. This vehicle offered uh, isofix anchorages as well, and this explained also the good performance in child occupant protection. Unfortunately, a lap belt uh, in the rear seat, which is expected by this time to have three-point belts in all sitting positions, explained the loss of points for the child occupant protection together with a uh, poor isofix marking and also uh, uh, not being possible to disconnect the, dry, the passenger airbag when there is a rearward-facing seat in that position. So overall, the car and the frontal offer a good protection. Now we are uh, starting to watch the side impact protection. This is where the car lost most of the points. As we can see, there is an important penetration of the movable barrier into the compartment. So we can see it much better from this point. And also that led to, and the lack of airbags combined with this deformation in the structure led to high injuries in the chest of the driver. This explains the zero stars on this vehicle. <coughs> At the same time, we found that the child occupant protection had a good uh, protection in the side impact, both dummies, the one and a half year old and the three year old. And that also explains the uh, three stars for child occupant protection. It is important to mention that this car on the side impact had a door opening in the rear, which is the, the line of the child occupants. And this would be a, uh, this point will be uh, one point where the car would not be able to approve regulation 95 for United Nations if you have a door opening, which this was the case. And that's if this vehicle would have been tested under that conditions, under those conditions, then probably the car would not pass this basic uh, side impact protection requirement. Last but not least, a summary of results. It's a Ford K8, two airbags as standard, zero stars for adults, three stars for child occupant protection. Remind you that the critical points we found in the car is the high penetration of the movable deformable barrier in the side impact that caused a door opening and also high injuries in the uh, adult chest. And with that, that actually those conditions explain that uh, uh, the result of zero stars for adults in the Ford KA. At the same time, we mentioned that the door opening in the rear would lead this car to miss or not pass the basic UN 95 side impact protection requirements.